everyone and welcome to a different kind of create a sim this one is color inspired so i am going to do blue today and starting with her name i am going to name her um i think royal kind of like a royal blue and then also a periwinkle uh for her aspirations so i kind of wanted around blue color so you know inspired and just kind of like that creative and also what kind of glows with blue gloomy mm, and what else here either loves the outdoors or um no i already did gloomy lazy I could do lazy because that's kind of like blue in my mind, if that makes sense. So now pretty much everything is going to be blue, um, you know, her clothing, her hair and that kind of stuff. But first, we're going to start out with her appearance, so her eyebrows, and just make her, you know, create the sim before we start doing the blue. So I'm definitely feeling like really, really plump lips for some reason. I know I always feel like that, but they're never plump, plumply the enough, <laughs> if that makes sense. And then just a cute little nose. Just a little tiny one there. Now, I'm not sure, like, I don't know. I always go with the pre-made noses and then try to adjust them the way I like them. But, you know, what I should do every single time is just, you know, go pre-made, 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 pre-made. There we go. My sim is done kind of thing. Because you guys say I'm good at creating sims. But in my opinion, I just find I'm just not. Because I don't really do a lot of custom. It's more of just pre-made. But, yeah, still working on her face. I don't like that, like, um, chin dimple thing. So I want to get rid of that, even though it kind of still looks like that. I feel like just small everything, small nose, but big lips, big eyes. Well, big and small. <laughs> her eyes, so I like them how they are. Kind of, like, crooked, not crooked, but, you know, um, I'm different. <laughs> and now for eyes, I do want her to have, like, the different eyes. So I do have some custom content eyes. Obviously, I'm going to do blue. Now, I don't know if I want, like, a light blue or a dark blue, but I think the dark blue is fine. Now, moving on to her hair. So I got to find hair that is blue that looks good. So there's a dark blue. Or there's this one. Okay, I'm really liking that one. But with the eyebrows, though... I don't know what to do because blonde doesn't look good, black doesn't look good, and these are more like a, I don't know, the blue colors are more of a green than a blue. I guess that one doesn't look too bad, but it kind of matched her hair, but oh well, I'm going to go with that anyways. Now for eyeshadow, yeah, that one is a little bit greeny blue, but that's okay. And some makeup, of course, a blush and lipstick. No, no blue lipstick, only because there is enough blue. Her hair, her eyebrows, her makeup, so we need something like to, what's the word, contrast it maybe, to look good, to, anyways, I don't want too much blue, <laughs> is what I'm trying to say, so I don't know if I feel like the dark, or the light, or what the heck I feel like, I'm just kind of going around choosing whatever I think will look good, now I always go to my favorites, and never really test out all the other ones, so I guess that's what I'm kind of doing now, but in the end, I'll probably go with my favorite one here. Now for her uh, body shape here, so change that up a little bit there, make her shoulders bigger, her boobies bigger, and of course her butt, and just change a little bit of that. There we go. Now clothing, so blue, and of course it doesn't have to be like the exact same color blue, you know, I was going for light blue, dark blue, all the different colors of blue. So colors, oh, and of course they don't have blue, they have every color other than blue, unless I'm just blind. Now I know I say this a lot, I might be blind because I just can't seem to see it I I just don't understand how they could not have blue like every other color no blue so I'm just gonna check this like a million times because maybe blue is gonna pop up at some point but obviously not that's just so stupid like I don't understand so I'm gonna go have to go through all the clothes and try to find the blue ones and see what looks good so that is okay but it has more colors than just blue that one's okay but it doesn't really look that great with her hair because it is two different blues so maybe i can get something that has a little white in it white and blue oh yeah okay this one works yep i'm liking it it matches her hair too so that's good it's like a bluey a bluey green and then of course i'm going to go with blue jeans and ones that look good with that so i like these ones i just have to find the right color of blue but i'm looking at all the other jeans of course they go under the shirt and i want them to go over the shirt so the shirt is tucked in 
but of course they're not. So I'm going to have to go, oh, okay, those ones are nice, but they're just up a little too high. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'm thinking these ones for sure and what color I have no idea I don't want to go black because it is a blue inspired. So definitely blue. Yeah, that looks okay Those ones there now. I don't know if I want to go like with blue shoes or just white shoes to match her shirt a little bit I'm not too sure now. I feel like boots because I always like to put boots on these type of pants But I usually go like a brown or something like that and of course, those ones don't look good with the pants. So I need ones that look good with the pants and then also have blue in them. Nope, those ones don't either. Okay, these ones are okay. They're blue. But I could also do the white, which is fine. We have enough blue, so I'm going to go with that. And for a formal, definitely a dress, a blue a dress. So that one looks okay. And it's hard to, like I said, because it is different blues. I, I'm so matchy-matchy that I wanted to match with her hair. Okay, that one looks okay. I'll go with white high heels. That works there. And of course, makeup for her formal here. Now, I don't know if I want the blue makeup for formal since there is already so much blue. So I might go with a white or something like that. I'm not exactly sure. I don't want to use the same makeup I did for the everyday. I know that for sure. So I'm going to go with that and for athletic. I might go with that top or even, okay, that tank top is fine, those shorts, so it has the blue and green with it. And now for formal, I'm thinking definitely that robe, it is good, party, so I don't know if I want to dress for party or exactly what I want, but I do really, really like this one, so I'll go with that. And of course, the white high heels because don't want too much blue. <laughs> Makeup for sure, um, I might just go with this one or more of like, a brown-ish color, neutral color. Oh, that one is nice. I like that one. Okay, definitely that one. Do some just winged makeup. Just changing it up a little bit. I always do the same thing. I want to change it up, and I really do like this look. And just the same lip. <laughs> I want to change it up, but I'm going to use the same lip. <laughs> and uh, what am I here? Okay, so a swimwear. I'll go with this one in the dark blue. So there are her outfits for the blue-inspired uh, Create a Sim. Now, I don't like that blue too, too much. So I'm going to see if there is a lighter one. Okay, that matches perfectly like with her hair. So I think that one is a go. <laughs> so that is her outfit and just the Create a Sim blue. So you guys definitely let me know if you want me to uh, do like more colored inspired um, create a sims like I can do you know yellow red well you know the color so you get it I'm just changing uh, her eyes because I totally forgot to do that for the rest of the outfit so yeah definitely don't forget to comment below if you want to see other colored inspired create a sims thank you so much for watching I really hope you guys enjoy it and don't forget to like comment and subscribe mm -hmm.